A fully grown three-year-old male lion is on the loose now in South Africa. The South African national parks are increasing the already massive hunt by bringing in staff from other parks to try to find the lion. Authorities say it's becoming more dangerous by the hour. Paul Tilsley joins us now on the phone from Johannesburg. What's the latest, Paul? John, the big development here is that Fox News has learned just over an hour ago trackers have found fresh lion droppings, or spore as it's known, on farmland a staggering 21 kilometers or 13 miles outside the park. That means the lion is on the move. It's become night here, and Farouche Ludic, the spokesperson for the Karoo National Park from where the lion escaped, said they unfortunately have had no choice but to call off the hunt for the night. Ludic told Fox News the longer the lion goes without food, the more dangerous it gets. She added it could be getting hungry now. Although the park is in a remote mountainous desert region, some 200 miles from Cape Town, there's concern because the main highway between Johannesburg and Cape Town passes right along its fence. This three-year-old male lion is believed by rangers to have lost a territorial battle with an older lion and been forced to leave the pride and climbed under a fence. But in a country still tense after a U.S. tourist was mauled to death by a lion just a week ago, South Africans are questioning why news of the missing lion is only breaking now. It escaped on Friday. That's because park officials say they were hoping to quietly catch the lion. But four days on, a helicopter, trackers from the local sand tribe, who've been hunting animals in these mountains for centuries, and even a specialist tracking dog have been unable to catch up with it. And park rangers have asked local people to help them find it, but not, John, to try and capture it themselves. This animal is totally wild. Well, scary. Paul Tilsley in South Africa. Thank you, Paul.